Oh, my chicles, it's Sunday y el cuerpo lo sabe y lo siente. But we didn't let that stop us from showing up to the 8 a.m. class. Honestly, I have no desire to be here. But what I keep telling myself is just suck it up, get there, let go, and let God. I also tell myself, you took a six-month break. Suck it up for one hour, you're investing in yourself. Y ya, na placo. One thing about this challenge they don't tell you is how much water you're going to end up needing to buy. And I totally forgot they sell these little Salud hydration packs at Target. Salud, if you're watching this, please sponsor your girl to get through this series. I had seen a flyer for a creative meetup during the week, and I told myself I'd see how I felt the day of. Of, and I just felt a calling to just go. I'm not gonna lie, I was nervous because I've never been to one and I had no idea if I was gonna know anybody there. But one of my goals this year is to meet more creatives and do more collaborative work. I was so happy I went. It was like speed dating, but for creative networking. Everyone's so friendly and so talented. I hope to continue pushing past my uncomfortable levels and attend more of these things. I'm really just trying to put actions behind the things that I say I'm going to do and actually doing them. And it just so happened to be that there was a creative meetup in the first week of January with all the more reason to show up no matter how how uncomfortable I might have felt in the moment. The quicker we accept these temporary feelings that we have, like fear or being uncomfortable, the quicker it is to push past these feelings. We tend to overhype things and build them up to be something they're actually really not, because it's really not that deep when you get down to it. Came back to my leftovers, finished my YouTube edit for my first video of 2024 on YouTube. It was a very fulfilling and productive Sunday to say the least. Anywho, los quiero mucho, los veo mañana.